It takes humans years of practice to get close to replicating this action. Um, and many people who do karate talk about storing up energy and releasing it over a very short time period, and they're able to um, break boards and so forth doing this approach. And it's in, in some ways that's analogous to the mantis shrimp, where you are generating a high peak force over a short time period to fracture something. The mantis shrimp's awesome power can hold a crab's shell with a single strike. Potential predators can also be on the receiving end. And that includes us. The best policy with manta shrimp is to not put your hands anywhere near them because they are really vicious animals. I have been uh, hammered by a shrimp. It's very painful. It almost feels like um, the sting of a bee, but without the stinger and you get a little red welt. But far worse is when they decide to stab you. It's just like someone putting a sewing needle right through your finger and it's awful. So the best thing to do is just to keep your hands out of the tank. <laughs>